my name is Charles. Hi, my name is Kyron. And we're reading Kid vs. Squid by Greg Van Eekhoff. And today it's a tough question about how this lobster man got to be one of Scala's main So, this, I, I'm thinking that this lobster man was used to be a, one of the float sand or maybe a keeper. Because or it could have been Scala's friend too. And then, because uh, in Griswold, um, that in Griswold's museum, Griswold told him uh, Thatcher that all of those, the Fiji mermaids and the dragon with the hat, they were all fellow keepers. And then Scala told, uh, turned them into those, those animals. Yeah, true. With her powers, because they're yeah. very strong, she can turn anybody into anything. Like, the squid could have been a person, and then she turned it into a frog. So maybe, so either he's a keeper, a float sail, one of the float sail, and maybe uh, he's a just a civilian. Yeah. The float sail is like. Because uh, Scala got really angry at them for, for what they did to her. Chopping her yeah. head off. And where did they put their body? You know? Yeah, that's what they're putting Oh, wait! Remember this? Uh, they had a uh, bummy in the. without a head. Without a head, it was like a That we just figured out. We really didn't. Yeah. But, yeah, so that's the end for us. My name is Charles. My name is Kyron. And we're reading Kid vs. Squid by Granite. Thanks for tuning into our video. Bye! Bye!